Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be going over the beginner's quest for Zenkai Origins. Uh, this video is mainly for those who are new to the game, who are wondering like what quest to do uh, and what you should do for like the first like 10 levels and where to go to quests and etc etc. This video will help you out. Now, I haven't gotten that far into the game, so I don't know what comes after what I'm about to show you. I'm still figuring that part out. I'm still exploring. But I can show you guys, you know, the path that I took and the quest that I did uh, to get where I am, which right now I'm actually level, uh, I'm level 24, so I'm, I'm getting somewhere. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. So when you guys are first new to the game, you're going to spawn in this little area next to Chi Chi. Now, Chi Chi, right off the bat, will have a quest for you to complete. I believe you have to defeat maybe four or five um wild dogs and those wild dogs can actually be located down this pathway like if you guys follow this path you'll actually come across the uh the wild dogs they're pretty easy to find and they're also really easy to defeat like wild dogs are ridiculously easy like you do not really have to worry about them too much they're super easy to kill um but yeah you do have to defeat i think either four or five i can't exactly remember how many but once you defeat these wild dogs, the quest will actually automatically turn itself in, which is a good thing. You know, you don't have to go back and forth, you know, talk to them again, turn it in. In this game, it automatically completes for you. So that's very nice. Uh, <laughs> honestly, I, I was surprised when that happened. I thought you had to go back and forth. Thank God you don't when it comes to certain quests. Now, once you guys defeat these wild dogs, you might be asking, okay, I go back to Chi Chi. She doesn't have a quest for me. Where do I go now? Like, what's the next step? And for that, basically, you know this pathway right here that we were following before? Um, oh, if I can run. This little pathway right here, if you guys keep straight, so you're coming up from over there, if you keep straight, there's actually a village way over here in the distance. Now, this village will actually have about, I think, five to six quests for you to complete. And that's basically where I am. I just got done with this village. I'm on my first quest into the next village, and I'll show you guys where that village is. Um, but basically, when you get to this village right here, uh, the first quest you want to pick up is actually going to be right here where his first house is. This guy right here. He will have a quest for you to defeat uh, the farmers. Now, I will say the farmers are a, a bit strong, uh, at least like when you're around level 5, level 6. These guys can pack a punch to you, so do be careful when you're fighting them. Uh, they do attack slow like they'll probably hit you once every three or five seconds So they, they do attack very slowly, but when they do hit you they hit you with force So you guys want to be careful and make sure that you keep an eye on your health and key because This is where the game starts to you know starts to ramp up a little bit in difficulty Now once you guys complete all these quests, I will say that uh, you want to avoid this guy right here at least let him be the last guy that you do so avoid this guy right here because uh, he'll have a quest for you to go and defeat a level 60 now you guys may be wondering Takio that's that's a high level level 60 that's high I'm only like level 7 like I have no hope of defeating level 60 don't worry guys even though it looks scary and there's a huge level gap the level 60 guy is actually pretty easy like I managed to to uh, to defeat him I think around level 14 or 15 I wasn't that high of a level and I managed to defeat him he's really easy he's not really that scary especially if you have a friend and that's the one thing I want to talk about real quick play this game with a friend if you don't have a friend try to find somebody who, who is also new and quest with them together this will make the game so much easier and go by so much quicker so keep that in mind when you guys are playing this game try to find a friend it'll make your life way easier but if you don't have a friend that's fine that's fine we all don't have friends okay i'm one of those guys <laughs> i don't have that many friends but it's all good it's all good so uh yeah save this guy for last do his quest once you're done with everybody else's quest here then do this guy's quest and then once you're done with this guy's quest you should be about level 18 level 19 you should be you know near level 20 uh and then from there i'll actually show you guys where the other village is at the one that i'm currently doing which is in this direction i believe 
Oh yeah, real quick, if you guys want to know how to fly, uh, while you're holding down shift, while you're running, if you double tap W, you actually start flying. And then space bars to go up and then controls to go down. Now the next village is, I believe, should be right over this little, um, this little mountain right here, this little hill. Straight forward. Let's see where the village is. Should be somewhere around here. Uh, let's see. Oh, there it is. Down there, right there where my curse is, right there. That's where the village is. That's the one I'm at right now. That I'm currently doing quests for. I'm not sure exactly how hard these quests are in this village because I just started it. But uh, I mean, this is basically the village that I'm at right now. So I guess we'll see uh, how hard the quest is. Oh, the server is about to reboot. That's interesting. But uh, yeah, you guys want to head to this village. There's a bunch of quests here. You have one, two, three, and then four. I think four quests here. So this is another area that you guys can go to the quests and uh, and level up. But uh, that's basically it for this video. I know it was a pretty short video. Honestly, I just wanted to go over some of the beginner quests and just you know help you guys get started on the game. Because I know for me, I was like running around for about 30 minutes, having no clue where to go after GG's quest. I was so confused. And hopefully this video will help you guys out and make sure you guys are not as confused. But uh, real quick before we go, I do have a Discord server, or actually I'm, I'm making a Discord server. So by the time I upload the next video, it the Discord server should be out and should be ready. Uh, and you guys can join it. And you can also, you know, meet new friends and possibly play this game together, you know, level up together and just enjoy this amazing Dragon Ball game. Um, but another thing is if you guys enjoy this video and you enjoy my content and my channel please please leave a like and subscribe it only takes like two seconds to subscribe and if you guys don't like my content or later on you just like you know you just don't like me you can always unsubscribe it's really easy but uh yeah with that being said i'll see you guys in the next video until next time peace out